Hey hello guys, it's How to Tech Simplified back again with another easy tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to fix it when Roblox gives the error that it has incompatible software so it can't run the game properly. Now it's a very common issue, it's a very easy solution and I'm going to show you straight away. The first thing that you want to do is open up your laptop or your desktop, go to search and type in Roblox player. Now as you can see it already pops up. We're going to press a right mouse button, open the file location, and as you can see right here, we have the file location open up. Now we're going to do Roblox player once again, right click it and open up the file location. Now here we have the player beta and the player launcher. Now it's important that we're right clicking the player beta first. From there we head down to the properties and inside the properties we're going to the compatibility tab right here and we're going to run this in a compatibility mode for Windows 8. Now from there we're going inside the settings and make sure that this is set to run this program as an administrator and to disable the full screen optimizations. From there press apply Press OK and go down to the Roblox Player Launcher, right click it, head down to Properties, Inside Properties, go to the Compatibility tab once again, run this program in Windows 8 as you can see right here, disable full screen optimizations and run this program as an administrator. Now from there we press Apply, press OK, now we can close down the file location and what we want to do next is we want to the search bar and from there type in Windows Defender Firewall. Now what this will do, it will open up the Windows Defender Firewall settings and here we need to allow an app or feature through the Windows Defender Firewall. Now from there we're going to type in R, so we're going straight to the R section and here we're looking for Roblox. As you can see, you can't find Roblox in the Windows Defender firewall settings. So what we want to do, we want to change setting in the top right corner. From there, allow another app. Now what you want to do here is we're going to look for the path that we want to insert right here. So simply head down to the file explorer or to the search bar and type in Roblox player. Right click it, open up the file location once again, right click it open up the file location and from there we have the file location. So what we want to do, we want to go inside this tab right here, we're going to press it, simply right click it, copy it and from there go to the Windows Defender firewall as you can see right here, go to browse, go right here, paste it inside of here, press enter and as you can see we have the Roblox player beta. Now from there, open it up, press add, and as you can see, now we've added the Roblox game client. Now we want to do this through the other .exe as well. So simply head down to browse, go to the search bar right here, press paste, press to the player launcher, press open, Press add and from there it should be allowed in the public network as you can see right here but also make sure to check the private network. Now from there we simply press OK. We can close these windows and that should be about it. Now make sure to restart your program, restart your PC or laptop so the um, settings can be set inside the PC and if this tutorial was helpful please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and thanks for watching.